Okay, hello everybody. Welcome back to Dragon Age Origins Awakening. I kind of wanted to show you something real quick. Um, but we got all the upgrades for Vigil's Keep. And see there, I completed the Nailish Shelf of Origins story. Made me, it made me teary-eyed. I won't lie. Um, yeah, I hopefully we'll be uploading that. I, up I was recording it as kind of a test to see if everything would work, but... Freaking heck. I'm stretching. <laughs> Corrupted. I have things to say about that, though. <laughs> I really like the character I made, too. Her name is Lynn. She looks so freaking good. Lynn means blood. Lynn means blood in Dalish. L-I-N. That's what it's, That's what the Wikipedia thing said, anyway. But let's let us fight. Have our sarcophagus. Which one did you did you do, though? Huh? You know what I mean. Let's see if we can look at the crypt statues. I don't know. Whoop! Oh, nope! How many? Oh man, so many! Okay, I'm throwing this on for sure. Uh. Oh yeah, oh, yeah I have that now too. Okay. Okay. Have our lord. Oh man, I don't know, like, y y you know, it's like, oh god, what do I do? Sure, let's just throw down some lightning, make it really freaking loud. He's got a sword of fire! Okay, hang on, I'm actually gonna do... If they're gonna close in... As you wish. I am going... Yeah! <laughs> Let's see, I don't know what this really does, but... Yeah. Attack! It didn't attack anything! And it did nothing! And I got some health back from that. Come back here! What are you yelling about, baby? It's a massive sword! Let's get started. It's like screeching. On it. Right, right. Let's get you need to hold still. Can I get you to hold still? This should be easy enough. Aha! Right. Let's get started. This should be easy enough. Right. On it. Right. Only for a second there. This should be easy enough. On it. Eh? On it. This should be easy enough. Okay. Time for some fun. Why are you dead yet? Oh, he's immune to what the oh spirit is oh immune to spirit, that makes sense. Uh nature? That seemed to work. Oh, let's um let's do that. Into the fray! Into the fray! I like that. Let's get started. On it, as you Wow, look at that! Sigrun! You look so freaky. I can't remember what that ability is, but it's awesome. What did we get? Ooh. Quest completed. You destroyed the wraith. With any luck, it's now gone for good. Good! I didn't realize I left a wraith wandering around. I legitimately thought that I'd finished it. Received a lot of money, but I can't pick up that dang nab glowing sword. Whoa! Some say this armor is for the cowardly, others say it is for survivors. Heavy armor. Wow! I'm gonna take that, I'll take that, yeah, I will take that. Wolf treads? <laughs> Restricted to a rogue? No fair! Oh! No fair! Oh, Master Larian potion recipe! Woo! Let me check. Where's my list? Oh, I've got to find the page with the list on it now. Is this the right notebook? Um. Um. I have a mat. Yes, I have the master. I have the Master Lyrium potion now. Okay, I will. I have that. I don't know why I need it, but I have it. Daisy cutter. Telekinetic? What? <laughs> what? Telekinetic. 
on the Avars that lived here. The Great Strife. Oh. Uh, okay. Warn inscriptions even the bowels of village keep. Uh, okay. Hang on, let me get the other one. Maybe it'll be... Oh, man. Okay. Let's see. Shoot. I gotta find it. Okay. Uh, uh, with our warriors, I'm matching skill and strength. And here we settled in the caves. He turned from the gods. Brought us low. He pursued her. And the dwarves protected Calais. That darkness drove him to magic. Or drove him to madness. Turned warriors against us. Kivil sought out the dwarves. And together they bound Rudin in this place. Remember Kivil. May Rudin forever be bound here. So that this, like, I think it, like, updated, didn't it? Like, each time we clicked on a thing. This is, like, it's, like, totally outside the area. It's, like, you would not know this was here. No more. There's the, the other one. So he had, like, electric and ice swords. And he had, oh, he had fire. Can't, why he had something, I can't remember. Okay, dokie. I have avenged you. I have laid to rest the spirit that inhabited this place. This is really cool. Avar god stuff. Like, or Avar people stuff. That's really cool to have that in here, of all places. I mean, it said why. They were like palsies. They defied the trade manifestos that were set down by... Look at all these dragons and stuff. This was really cool. You know, if these statues ever started moving, I wouldn't trust them ever again. Wouldn't trust them ever again. Easily assembled. So I guess I could just sell the stuff. Oh, I should probably go talk to Mr. Swoolsey before I sell those things. But first, we're going to go to Amaranthine. I have the Grandmaster Flame, and I have I, that, but I need, I'll need to rewrite somebody to have Master Herbalism. I don't know why I need that, though. It's a mystery! Attached to that cat, <laughs> Anders. <laughs> it's more that he's rather attached to me. Isn't that right to bounce a lot? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that name a little ridiculous? What do you think I should call him? Frederick? There are worse names, I suppose. It's a cat! Is she uh, She's not actually carrying it. Is she just meowing or is she actually carrying the cat? She might actually be carrying the cat. No. Oh. Okay, that must just be inside then. Master herbalism. Uh, oh, yes. Now we're going to go to Amaranthine. Drop off Micah's necklace. It's a nice name, Micah. It's what you could call a rock type, mineral type too, M-I-C-A. Just regular. Stefan? Who is this Stefan? I'm a safe. <laughs> Yay, City of Amaranthi. Who's Stefan? Should I know that name? I knew you'd make it back here. Have you sold that thing I gave you? Oh, much, he's the guy I saved. Get a good price for it. You're sure you're not infected with the dark spawn team? No, I feel fine. But you don't think I am. Uh, maybe I should just go. Is that going to have like horrible repercussions down the line? Homer's toys? What? What is that all about? Bell collar? I think Anders wants the bell collar. For his key cat. When the city runs out of supplies, we are all doomed. We are all doomed. And Anders. You shouldn't have. 
Eh, I think I have maxed him out at, at this point. I don't know who the Lyrian ring is for. Anders, do you love me? Do you love me? It's Micah's, not Colbert. Woods are slippery when wet. Be careful. You're back, Colbert, eh? not Colbert. What's it like out there? Dark spawn crawling all over? Uh, I... Or I'll show them. The, I'll show, show them the lucky deer foot. Thank the maker. Meek has been afraid to move from this spot since he lost a stupid thing. <laughs> Sorry, couldn't go without lucky deer foot. Thanks for finding it. You weren't very and lucky. And now we're when getting you away fell. before the dark spawn arrive. Good luck to you. Oh, you're such a good friend. Waiting with your paranoid friend. Okay. He seems thankful to have his charm back, although it was hard to tell. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. That is funny. Oh, compa- Right, the Ogryn. Oh, I think I saw something about this online as being one of the... The bugs in that you could- You could- You could get a high enough approval rating with him to trigger the family man, but you couldn't get high enough to actually complete it. Because of the way, the stupid way that's set up. You know, you notice that, like, his, his, his approval started out in the middle. Oh, well, you can't see it from here, I guess. But his approval started out, like, back at square one, right? But the game had it set so that it, re it, it still had triggered the fact that you had given him gifts. So all the gifts you give him are only going to be six. And then anything else you give him is just going to be plus one. And plus, for some reason, it just reset. It's just reset his approval back down, which it shouldn't have. Really, I saw. I see a fire in there. There's a fire in there. There's a fire in there. Oh, I guess I'll uh, I'll take uh, your command. This off while I'm just running around. Yeah, Lynn's voice though is really funny. The guards, they won't let anyone into the city, but it. Um. Look, another kitty cat! Another kitty cat! Somebody, I thought somebody said that I could get a kitty cat out here in the courtyard. Um, in an amaranth theme for Anders, but I found, the one I found was in the, I just, when I edited the other day, it was in the, um, in Vigil's Keep, so I don't know if there's just multiple places you can get it or what. Is that all we had to do in amaranth theme? What was that quest part of, anyway? That was part of Knotwood Hills. Okay. Oh. Oh, I haven't been to the Chantry yet. Meow. 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 I completely forgot that I haven't been in there yet. I noticed it while I was editing, though. I was like. I was like, I was talking to Wynn in it, and I was like, I have not been in that chantry yet. <laughs> My bad. I don't know what to expect in here, to be honest. Eh? You gonna talk about this statue? Nope. Uh. Oh! Oh, uh, whoops. Uh, I, I already did that. You spelled praying wrong. It, it's, it's with an A. <laughs> I know, that's probably supposed to be the joke. Um. Oh, hey. Uh, I can do that. I can do that. I have tons of injury kits. Where, where would you like me to bring them? Oh, right, okay, here, um, have them. Repent and have faith, and you shall know the peace of the Maker's benediction. I'm sure, I'm, I'm sure. Oh, okay, I did it. Yay! That means, and there was one of the, one of the little achievements I didn't have actually was, um, oh, I didn't do it. There's a chanter's board. <laughs> Part the pilgrim completed a chanter's board quest. I guess it doesn't count if you're not in origins, but that's why. 
That's why I did it, but whatever. It's good to help. Good to help. Could have done the other ones, but at some point, but. Good golly, Sigrun! Turn off the thing! You look like you've got, like. Oh my gosh, I thought something was wrong. Is anywhere safe? Anywhere at all? The guards. They won't let anyone into the city. Sigrun! I can't handle it! The walls. I can't handle it! Is it this one? Okay, you can be that kind of a glowy, but you can't be this kind of glowy. Make his blessings to you, sir. Right, I had to talk to her if I want to do the other questy thing. One of the questy things. Can we steal it from the Chantry? Do you mind? I have completed the task. Cool, private documents. That's exactly what I wanted. Lost and found. A knitted scarf. Who wants a knitted scarf? That music, though, makes you want to, like, walk very slowly. Alma? The sins of man brought the blight to us. And now this. The sins of you. We must follow the example of Andraste and reflect upon the chance... Yes, don't do anything else. Just sit around. Would do well to heed this lesson yes. Join us in mm hmm Yeah. <laughs> it's not like Karam to be gone this long. I was sure I would find him at the inn. What? Who? Karam? Didn't I? No, I found a, a, somebody else. Karam? What? Have I found a Karam? Did I get that too late? Records. This is set up like the other Chantry. Blank journal. Oh, um... Uh, Valina likes them. Likes those. Like, she likes journals. She likes a way to tra keep to write down her thoughts and the thoughts of those, uh, those of her clan that she meets. Or those of the elves. He moved into his smallest house. He spent many years there before dying. Okay. Revered mother, you're probably a witch. Not actually a witch, you know what I mean? Yay, you guys have, like, nothing here. Pilgrims and Amaranthine. This is a very well-designed chantry, though. I must say. For origins, you know? Uh... Can I go up? Hello, everybody! Worship the elven gods, they don't talk to you either. Yay, amen! Have you delivered your annual tithe to the chantry, sir? <laughs> I think I'm overdue many, many years. Okay. So there was not, like, anything... Of course, maybe if I'd have gone in there earlier, there would have been something in there, you know what I mean? Need to make a Master Lyrium Potion. Okay. Uh, what was... Oh, I gotta go to the house outside of town. Oh, and we gotta go to the inn. Do you have anything on you yet, lady? Sigrun, I understand how difficult surviving poverty can be. When I came back from the free marches, I had nothing. No money. Uh, no it's family. always kind of funny when nobles try nothing. to empathize with I'm poor sorry. people. I didn't know that. You have my respect for surviving what you did. <laughs> I, I didn't survive. Legion of the Dead, remember? Oh. Oh. You're alive. And he's too literal to understand that. <laughs> nah, he gets it. I mean, he really did. He's not... He's definitely not your typical noble, but despite, you know, a non-typical... Just being a noble at any point in time, really, if you were born to it, you're gonna have a different life and a different point of view. Note fragment. Oh. You found the fragment of a note written by Alma's husband. Apparently, it had been discarded. He mentioned the catwalks high above the city. Did he commit suicide? Um, his treasure may remain there in a small house outside the city. Okay. Did I go in here ever? I must have nothing in here. 
So that's all. Is that all I need to do with that? With with him? Catwalks. Catwalks. Okay. Time to go outside. Oh, the other, the Lynn, the Dalish Elf I started, I, I, uh, I put her on hardcore, on hardcore mode. Hard mode. So, before I actually do that, before I actually play that ever, I'm gonna have to do a lot of research and stuff. Catwalks. Is this a catwalk? On the catwalk! On the catwalk! <laughs> Such a weird song. Hey, have you seen a guy? If anyone can get rid of the ah! I understand it's hard to keep uh, keep up to date with things, you know, when you're up here and nobody relieves you or something. Okay. These are the battlements. These are not catwalks. It's so weird that it automatically... Like, they're not even like a loading screen. Like, I mean, no loading screen is fine, but at least let the screen fade to black or something for a second. Find you, Anders. Incredibly angry. That's how they find me. There must be some trick to it, surely. They began recruiting women. <laughs> the male Templars never stopped to ask for direction. <laughs> You're impossible to talk to. Yeah. I do my best. Uh, they track him with his phylactery. I thought everybody knew that. Mm -hmm. Cause he never was able to get rid of it. Keeping an eye out for anything glowing mysteriously. There's buckets everywhere. If anyone can get rid of the smuggler, it's the Grey Warden. Eh? See, something like that. If anyone can get rid of the smugglers, it's the Grey Wardens. Ah! Ah! I couldn't get in this door before, right? Oh. Well, where is he? Oh, yeah, and apparently, um... Let's see... Sigrun's quest is supposed to get triggered, but it's supposed to get triggered apparently if we, because we did law and order there's a guy we are supposed to talk to who is now permanently gone because we did that quest so yeah it looks like we're not going to be able to do hers or wherever this guy is Well, a cat walks of amaranthine. This is what it was, right? High above the city. I don't know. Maybe that was part of it, and I just messed it up somehow. That's fine. That's fine. I don't care. I love having unmarked check marks. Could I get... Is this one different? If anyone can get rid of the smugglers, have I been up here? Oh, note fragment. Gosh dang it! He found another fragment of a note in which he laments his failure to meet her dream of buying and restoring an old abandoned house. The house itself may yield further clues. Okay. Man. Oh, what's this? Was this here before? Thank you for the health poultices that I never, ever, ever need. Is, uh, should I, like, are these, like, two quests gonna, like, combine in a horrible way somehow? Which house? There's a lot of abandoned houses out here. Is it this one with the smuggler? What? 
What old house? Okay, here's one. Nope. Here's one. Oh, oh, is the one down there? Maybe we'll go down there. I'm surprised people haven't just like started camping in these houses. I saw a shiny thing. Pack. What? Oh, is that his treasure? You found his uh, treasure. Let's see what it is. A uh, ring of subtlety. Not all men are severe. When equipped with the ring of severity, the character gains a bonus to health regeneration. Well, dude. Just the one is not going to help me. Is that house on fire? Is it supposed to be on fire? Did you guys see a man? Oh my gosh, are you serious? Figures. Freaking, that's so stupid. That's so and Nobody heard that? Nobody heard him strangling to death out here? I hate that. I'm unworthy of you. I'm gonna kill myself. No, pff, man up. Like, you know, you know what, what a real, like, man or what, what a woman would do? Somebody who had guts? They would live with their mistakes. They would try better. They wouldn't just give up. I hate that. I'm not worthy of you, my love. No, you're just tired of being alive and struggling and not making it anywhere. This is all on you. It's not on her at all. Like, and it's not, I'm not saying that it was on, like, not saying that somebody was saying it was on her, but it's just like, man, I mean, I know depression is, it's, it's a horrible thing. And you get, you get stuck in a rut in your head and it's not just a matter of snapping out of it. You can't do that. I don't know why I went there. Um, you can't just snap out of it. It's like, it's, it's hormonal, it's like chemistry, it's mental, it's emotional, it's all these things. You can't just snap out of depression. But you can reach out. You can ask someone. He could have talked to her and she could have said, you know, hey, no, it's fine. Like, you know, and, and then if she just said something that had made the situation worse, like, it would have been her fault. But it's also, it's always in the person's hand. If you take your own life, your life is in your own hands. It's not anybody's fault. That's, I don't know. Maybe that's the way you want it. If you want that, that's that's your issue. But I just it's like with that, like he's gonna hurt. He, he's gonna by being by killing himself, he's hurting his wife a thousand times more than having a life of hardship and poverty would. Because now she's gonna have a life in hardship and poverty by herself. He hung himself. Oh, Karen, why couldn't you have told me? Now nah, she's probably gonna go kill herself. Great. Love being the bearer of bad news. Love it. Yeah, whatever. Just me, some random stranger, getting involved in somebody's life. I know it's a video game, but sometimes it's kind of weird. Especially when you don't talk, when you're not a voiced protagonist. Anyway, let's see what else we've got. Uh, Black Marsh, Wending Wood, not gonna happen, not gonna happen, probably. Okay, so it did say that the cat gut was in the Black Marsh, so hopefully, yeah. So it looks like what we have to do now is, I'll, I'll run a Vigil's Keep really quick. Just, I don't know, just for, you know, the sake of running back and you know, trigger, if, if anything needs to be triggered, hopefully it will trigger. And then we will go to the Black Marsh, which is cool. I think I lost that little walkthrough I was looking at that was, like, perfect and awesome. That was, like, I just, like, glanced at it, like, when I figured, how I figured out that I messed up Sigrun's quest for sure. Or that I had probably messed it up for sure. Now I'm, like, 99% sure. But, uh... Yeah, um, 
I can't find it anymore, and it was like perfect. It just gave you like it was like it gave you like a bulleted list of go here, go here, go here, go here, go here. Like go to you know Wending Wood, then Not Wood, you know, or interchangeable, you know. And then go back to the Vigil, and then go to the Wending Wood, and then go to the Black Marsh, and then go back to Vigil, and then go back to Black Marsh or something. I'm not quite sure on that, but. So you never told me what the ceremony was like. It begins with chanting and toasts. Then we bid our families farewell. Then wailing and tears. That does sound like a funeral. How depressing. We're not the legion of jaunty pub songs. <laughs> I think how much easier recruitment would be if you were. Oh my gosh, you are so irreverent. Irreverent. Um, yes, back on in. We'll go just pop back on in. Then see if anybody is going to cutscene. If any of my companions are going to cutscene with me. Let's just go poke Ogren and see if he'll say anything. Need something pummeled? Nope. Okay. <laughs> I think we are good. I can't believe I gave Elven Prayers of the Dead away. Pretty sure I did. Pretty sure I gave it to her. Ugh. Ugh. That's so aggravating. I'm sure some of you are like, No, why are you doing that? I'm like, Pfft. Cause, cause I'm an idiot. Commander. Bop, bop, bye. B -b -b bye. Commander. There are regular. Yep. Now that the wind. Uh -huh. Master Wade. Yep. It's chaos in the. Chaos. Their in last the reports indicate. Is that in the Black Good Marsh? Day, Commander. Oh hey. Uh, I'm here to serve, Commander. Vice out, treasure. Armor. Okay. Very well. So I can sell the goods I got from her then. I like that they put up some of my treasures. That's kind of cool. I think I think they did. The dragon egg, I think, is mine. The golem suit. I don't think they were here before. They totally might have been. Pretty sure they weren't. I do love the music in here. I think I commented on it way back. I was like, the music is so nice in here. But then somebody in the comments said that they really liked the song when you're in Vigil's Keep. And I was like, I can't recall. But I had just forgotten that I had. But I just edited that part a little while ago where I said, I really like the music in here. So, I don't know. I'm not good at keeping track. <laughs> I, I double up a lot because I play this and then I edit it later. So, I'm like, it's funny because sometimes I'll be like, hey, friend, remember this thing that happened specifically such and such and such? And she's like, No. And they're like, I was like, why not? It was so good, you know? Like, a couple of my friends, I'm like, it was so good. How come you don't remember? You like this game, too. Mass Effect, something or other. And they're like, well, you know, you play it, and then you have to watch your recording over again. Plus, you play multiple times. So, I was like, that's true. It's pretty, some of these things are pretty ingrained in my brain. Um, but anyway, after this, we're going to go to the Black Marsh, which I'm excited about. Because I think it's like the last third of the game, hopefully, is what I'm kind of under the impression of. So... We'll see. Hopefully I haven't screwed us up even more. So thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you in the next one.